Hi guys, how's it going today? Now I'm gonna be sharing with you in today's video some really cool Instagram hacks. You can apply these to your Instagram story and get some cool results. Let's not keep you waiting any longer. Let's just jump right in and get started. Okay, so hack one is called the eraser effect. Now this is pretty simple to do. First up, you need to make sure you're in the Instagram app by clicking like that. Then of course you want to go into your story because this video is all about story hacks. So go ahead and click on the camera and this will take you into the story setting where you can take a picture. Now just go ahead and blast a picture off like that. It doesn't matter what it's of because we're not going to use this anyway. Then go up and open the GIF. You can do this by clicking this square face here and then go down, just click across, make sure you're in the GIF setting and open it up. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna choose an effect called diamond or gem, I'm gonna go for diamond. And then when you've done that, go ahead and press enter. Now what you wanna do is you wanna choose a diamond which is sparkling. Now I find the two best diamonds for this effect is this one here or that one there. So I'm gonna go ahead and click this. And then when we've got this in the middle of the screen, just open it up wide, make it really big so it covers the screen like that. Now this is probably looking pretty wacky right now, but give me a minute and you're gonna see how cool this effect is. So go ahead and download this to your phone by pressing the download button there. When this is downloaded to your phone, you just actually wanna discard this because we're just gonna use this on its own. So go ahead and press the X and then press discard. Now you're gonna be in the story setting again, press on your gallery and choose that diamond effect which you've just downloaded. Okay, so this is where it gets pretty cool now. So what we wanna do is go ahead and click on this squiggle here, which actually gives you different pen effects and eraser effects. Make sure you're in the first effect here, which is actually highlighted in white. Click on black and then just hold this down on your screen. And you're gonna get a white background, which actually should be black. Let's click on black again like that. Now when you've got a black screen, all you need to do is click on the eraser effect up here. And when you've clicked on that, now you just need to write in some text like this rocks smiley face. And as you can see, you've got this awesome eraser effect, which just shines and sparkles in the background of your text like that. Story hack two on Instagram is a fun hack. Now, if you haven't already at this point, please go ahead and check out my Instagram and follow me at Ben's Guides on Instagram. I would really appreciate the guys trying to build up my Instagram account and that would be much appreciated. Now, this fonts hack is really easy. Currently, if you go into your fonts, you can see that you only have these settings up here and you only have about five or six. But a way of getting more fonts like this down here, which I've currently got, is to use something called fonts. You can see all these different fonts you can choose from, and it's a really cool addition to make your story stand out. The way to get this is to click out of your story and then to go into your Google Apps or Play Store or whatever store it is that you're actually currently on your Android, click on it, and then choose something called fonts, emojis, and fonts keyboard. Download that and how to actually get this working on your stories is to go over to your Instagram profile, click on this, make sure you're on your stories and then go over to text. Click on the text and then you will see an option on mine which it's already chosen. But if it doesn't show up straight away, click on this keyboard down here and you'll have the setting to choose from which is called fonts. Now this is really awesome and it's something you've got to do to actually get more text and more different styles on your stories. When it's chosen, you can go ahead and use this free and add in all kinds of different text onto your stories, just like this. So you probably already know at this point using Instagram stories that you can create a solid background layer. Now, if you don't know how to do that, I will show you, but I'm gonna show you something a lot cooler and it's called transparent backgrounds. And you can create some really awesome effects with this. So all you need to do is go ahead and click into your squiggle line here, which is gonna give you your pen and eraser effects. Make sure you're on this setting here, and then all you need to do is click a color, like this yellow, press and hold it down, 
and then it's going to change to white. How annoying. <laughs> now, if you actually click on yellow properly, press and hold it down, then you can just click on any of these colors and create a really nice solid background color. And this can be a really nice background to put on your stories. But to take this a step further, it's actually better to sometimes create transparent effects so you can see through to the picture below. Now the way to do that is to actually just, let's click this off, let's go back some steps. And then the way we're gonna do this is we've got this picture here. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click back and I'm gonna go into text. Now for some reason, you have to make sure the text is on classic. So just click across until you've got classic there. And then when you have classic, what you need to do is you just need to create something like uh, a period mark here, or you can even use one of these marks. Create some spaces. Stick with me guys and you'll see what I mean. And then create another one. And then watch what happens when I press a color. I'm gonna get them into the color. If I press this A up here once, I get a solid color. And if I press it again, I get transparent, which is awesome. So if I then just go back, down, I can now drag this out and create a really awesome transparent background. Now you can make this a lot cooler by actually doing multiple transparent backgrounds. So I can drag this down here, create a kind of style there, and then I can create another background. So I just go into it again, click, and then I can go onto a, another setting. So this time I'll go for that, lots of spaces, then another one, and then press this, and then press that, press it once again, and then I've got this color here. I wanna make it transparent, so press it again, and then I've got another cool effect. And this is transparent layers that you can add on top of each other and create some really cool, awesome designs. Now, it's difficult to do this while I'm recording, <laughs> but as you can see, you can create some really awesome designs by doing this. Now, this is really simple to do, and it's definitely something you should check out and something you should put into your own workflow and definitely start playing around with it. Okay, so everyone on Instagram uses emojis. They're just one of the most popular things which are used. But did you know that you can get glowing emojis? Well, now you do, and you can add them on your stories. So just go ahead and take a picture of whatever it is you're gonna take a picture of, or grab a picture from your gallery. So I'm just gonna take a picture of my desk again. And then all you need to do is go into your text settings here, click on it, and change over the text setting to neon. When you've changed it over to neon, you can go ahead and choose an emoji. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and click this one here because I'm really hungry and that looks like I've got lots of saliva coming out my mouth. And then I'm gonna click on a color. And look what happens. If I just go and click down here, you can see now that I've got this really cool glowing emoji. Now you can do this with as many emojis as you like. So you can mix and match these and create some really funny stories. So I'm going for a pig snout. And this is now on a white glow. And then you can choose this blue, yellow, red, whatever color it is. And this is just a really cool thing which you can do, add into your stories and just have an extra something. So that is the glowing emoji effect, really simple to do. For me, the best hack is actually to use another program called Canva. If you have not used this program already, then my God, you will wonder how you went without it. So all you need to do is go onto your Google uh, Play Store or whatever phone it is you're using, the Play Store there, and then download Canva as you can see here. When you've done that, click on it when it's open, and then you will straight away see that you have options if you scroll down for Instagram posts, Instagram stories, Facebook posts, social media, collages, posters, flights, just about everything. I'm not gonna go into it all now. And let's just go onto the Instagram story. I'm gonna click here, see all. And all these here are free templates which you can use and you can adjust these to your needs. You can also go ahead and click on a blank template and then create different designs with that. But I'm literally just gonna click on one design here now and quickly show you how it can work for you. I'll click on this one and press edit. Then now I'm able to edit this to basically look how I want it to look. If I press this plus down here, it's as simple as having these settings or these options here to choose from. You've got text, image, video, stickers, illustrations, templates, logos, page. You've got everything you can think of. If you were to just go ahead and click in text, you've got all these awesome fonts free. Now, of course you do have a pro package which you can choose for about 10.99 a month 
and I say that you should definitely check that out if you're someone that's going to use this for more than Instagram and all the parts of your social media. But for Instagram alone, you're going to get so much out of this free package. So literally just choose a font and then you can click on that and then start adding this in by changing the color. I've chose white and then I can just click on my font again and you can see it's now white. I can then drag the picture around. I can then go in and choose images. I can choose them from my phone or I can choose from a whole host of images that they actually have inside Canva. Most of them are free, but you also have some really cool pro images and you can search from them just by typing it in here. So if I put photo and then click go, you're gonna get a whole list of images which you can use absolutely free. Now you can just click on it and click and drag the size of it in there. Now I could go on this for about another 20 minutes showing you what to do, but all you need to know is if you play around with this for a little bit, you're gonna get so much out of it and your Instagram stories are gonna stand out. When you've actually got the design you want, click download and then it will download onto your phone. When your actual design is downloaded onto your phone, simply just go ahead onto Instagram and all you need to do is go and press on your app go into your stories and then click in here and choose your Canva picture, which you can then use the right dimensions on Instagram. If you found today's video useful, then why not follow me on Instagram? Also, if you can hit subscribe and the notification bell to watch more videos like this in future. Now, whatever you do for the rest of the day, guys, make sure it's a good one and I'll see you in the next video.